everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro in just a moment. I'm Mike Emmerich, and tonight, even though it's a team sport and people are seated in the stands right now, thrilled to watch a team play another team, they are thinking about one particular player. It's hard not to think about this guy because he's so dominant on the ice. But what's it like to be him? Well, you know the responsibility, Doc, and that comes with a burden, so to speak. But when you talk to him, he certainly relishes in the role that he has. And whether you're a star player or a role player, you have to do two things. You have to accept and execute, and he's able to do it all regardless of the stage. Tavares' ability to execute is what separates him from a lot of players in this league, Doc. People know when he is on the ice. If they are in this building or watching at home, you've got to keep your eyes on him all the time because he has the ability to do something that a lot of players in this league can't. We direct our attention to the Nets and the starting goalies. Frederick Anderson wheeled into Anaheim and made the NHL's all-rookie team in his first year, winning 20, losing only five. Henrik Lundqvist gets the nod in goal. In addition to having won the Vezina Trophy, earned Sweden Olympic gold in 2006 with an all-alone save in the last 10 seconds of the deciding game. Face-off number one gets us underway. This is Toronto, where hockey's special, and it started. Trying to go to Zabanejad. Gains the zone. Knocks it away with the stick. The Maple Leafs are moving the puck in their own end. Right up the side. Fires, and it's driven away again. Makes the stop and holds for the whistle. Down near the players is Ray Ferraro. The only way to win tonight is going to be to sustain a four check. Don't let them push it on you. You have to control that area of the game. Okay, Ray, thank you. Right to the point. And he picks it up. Brings it in for an attack. Slid to Shea. A shot. That's terrific goaltending. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. A great wrist shot. May not have been intentional, but he got it anyway. He's got that point pass. A shot. Holds on and gets that whistle. Danish-born goaltender Frederick Anderson, a big guy, six foot four, 229 pounds. Not much net in behind him when you're looking at that cage. And how about this? He only played two periods to get his first NHL win. He came in after his team was trailing in the first period. He had two shutout periods to earn his first National Hockey League win. Chip to Shea. Oh, snaps the shot. Score! That's a good start for the visiting squad. One, nothing. Always interesting, guys, after the first goal is scored, whether the team that scored is going to continue to attack or whether they'll sit back a little bit. New York's ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. Scored by number 20, Chris Crater. Moving it to Hainsey. Creating Sky. And by number 16, Ryan Strong. Time of the Fires. Game. A textbook stick save. Gotten quickly back. And now it's directed to Kreider. Flings it. Loud pad save. Offensive possession here. Long lead pass to Shea. Let's it go. That one counts. He put it in himself. Man, Doc, I don't know what he is thinking. This is a blackout shot into his own net. I, I can't even come up for an excuse for what he is doing here. He needs to sit down and think about it. 
Just over seven minutes have been played in the first period. And so their lead now is two. They're looking to pull away in this thing. Scored by number 20, Chris Crater. And he dumps it in. Seven minutes. Trying to get rid of that puck. Tried to clear, but couldn't. Quick wrist shot. Kick save. Outstanding. It's dumped in. Makes that play deep. To Johnson. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Sends to the point. Shoots one. Propelled to Muzzin. Strong shooter against a strong goaltender and the guy with a trapper won. The Rangers bench really got excited when they saw their goaltender make that amazing stop. The Rangers with a clean win on the draw. The Rangers lug that along up the wing. Perfect receipt of the pass. Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in play. The Rangers win the draw. A point blast. Outstanding save. What magic even to get there and get the shot off. Looked like the net was open for a second, but he shut it down. Oh, the goaltender read this really well. He's down in the butterfly, and he's going to stop this all day. A little under nine minutes to go in the period. Two goals have been scored, both by one team. Redirected. Got the save there. Good job on the draw. Wonderful work done near the blue line. Good intercept in his own end. Back and forth they go between the points. That's a great save. Outstanding job done at the blue line to hold the pressure on. Great save in close. A timely save. That is tremendously tremendous. Steps in from the neutral zone. A shot. Got his pad on that one. Couldn't make it through. Can't retain possession. Toronto's on the move, hoping to wheel it up the wing. Long saucer to Muzzin. Strong wrister. That hits somebody. And he gains the zone. Stole that pass away in his own end. Shot on. Had it away with authority. All a part of generating an offense. Little pass off from the goal. In with it now. Takes that pass. What a ripper! Drives it. Skill play by Muzzin. Laid on to Strom. Terrific poke check. Toronto's lugging it up the wing. Shoots one. A strong pad stop there. Directing that one to D'Angelo. Puck is thrown to Buchnevich. Nearing the 20th minute of this period. Crosses that line. Last minute of play. Shoots one. Oh, and it's off the mark. When the puck sounds hard, when it hits the end boards, that means you've missed the net. Scoring chance is handed away. Snapping a pass to Howden. Great job in his own end with that interception. A shot. First period stats are final. We'll have some more entries as the second and third periods are forthcoming. 
A pair of pucks entered the net in that period, both from the same set of sticks. It's 2-0. Do you know someone in your community who goes the extra mile to help out? The Rangers haven't given up a goal yet. And on the strength of big saves like this one, they might not the rest of the game. More in a moment. Second period about to begin here. Let's take a look back at the first. What stuck out for you? The Maple Leafs didn't play with the puck much in that first period. It's reflected on the scoreboard. They'll need to gain more possession time in order to generate more chances and turn things around. Let's it go. Great pad stop. And angled to Zabanajad. Toronto's continuing on in their own end. Gains that offensive line. Let's it go. That puck was obstructed by a screen. Take it to the slot. Good defensive read with that one. And freezes play for the whistle. Anderson's going to be able to make that save all day. His positioning is perfect. It's not a difficult scoring chance. Solid face-off win. Fires! Use that big goalie stick well. Good face-off win. Quick shot. Score! That's three in a row. The goalie was surprised at how quick that snapshot got on him. Anderson's not able to get his glove on that. It beats him low to the glove side. The Rangers lead in puck possession, and they've dominated. And they've got a 3-0 lead to show for it. Neutralized face-off win. Scored by number 44, on to Johnson. Assisted by number 16, Ryan Strong. Time of the goal, three minutes, 20 seconds. Gives it seconds. to the point. Shoots. Smart recovery by Faust. Pitching this one to Peon. Is able to move on in. Moves it to the corner. Let's the shot fly. Nicely padded away. And they are in. Shoots and a save. Broke it up well with the poke check. To Kreider. The Rangers have the puck at center ice. The pad flashed out to turn that aside. Shot. A wonderful save at the goal crease. That second save was textbook. I don't know if he's going to make a save much easier than that one. He's in good position. It's a rather routine stop. The Rangers prevail again. Waffle boarded. Toronto skating in their own end, trying to get to the neutral zone. And that puck goes offside. Toronto's collected another victory on the faceoff. And in flight over the line. Got a piece of that one. A little pass from his goalie here. Passing one off now to Nemesnikov. A howitzer. Routine save.
That shooter might want to check his stick. If that's all that he's got in the arsenal, it's not going to score very often. Over nine minutes off the clock here in the second. The Rangers just keep building on their lead. They're up now by three. They won that face off. Try to generate something. Puck grab. What's next? Slid to Zabanajad. Gets that one on across. Slides it to the point. That shot redirected. He holds that one, and it's a good thing because they were buzzing. Oh, he makes the save and stops play. This rink looks like it's tilted. Toronto's prevailed on another faceoff. The Maple Leafs are skating it up at neutral ice. Brings a shot. That shot came from right in front. Fantastic setup and equally great stop by the goaltender. Ran into the defense. He's lost it. The Rangers with possession in the neutral zone. Tries to get it on net. Great save. That puck is held and the whistle stops play. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Solid, clean win. To Kapanen. Looking to Matthews. Has it in his own end. The Rangers with control at center ice. And he dumps it in. Toronto's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. Driving in from no man's land. Shoots. Shot. Outstanding point blank save. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. The Rangers up the wing luck the puck. Good place to shoot from. Solid work there by Muzzin. Let's a shot go. Broke it right up. Nice play with the stick. He scores. Patrick Marlowe. key to this goal is the quickness of his release. It gives him the advantage on this play, and the puck gets past the goaltender in a hurry. You make a mistake that bad, most often the next place the puck is, is in your net. And there it is. The Maple Leafs have worked this back to a two-goal deficit now. Let's see if they can make it one before the end of the period, period number two. The Rangers control at center ice. By number 12, Patrick Marlowe, assisted by number 20. Gathered up by Marlowe. Pass attempt to Nylander. Takes that pass from the other point man. Terrific pad save. He hit the crossbar. The Rangers are at the wing in neutral ice. He takes that point pass. Perfect pass. Players tired, about to get a rest. Seconds to play here, still in the second period. That's what those pads are for. Chip to Hyman. Got a piece of it with the glove. Can start the attack going in the zone. On the outside, a shot. Save there. Good shooting place. Wonderful stop. Two periods are in the books here. And so one more to go. And maybe overtime. But it's been an entertaining first two. Time to look at the shots on goal. 21 for the Rangers. And 15 for Toronto. Don't forget, fans, if you're here with somebody celebrating... His team is behind. It would be further behind if not for big saves like this one. Intermission is next.
40 minutes down, at least 20 minutes to go. What are your thoughts so far? Toronto's got a real tough task ahead of them as we get ready for the third period. They know they're facing a hot goaltender. They know they've created a lot of chances. They need a bounce. They need to get a greasy goal. In order to do that, you've got to put yourself right in front of the goaltender. Around it again. Up to the point. Cranks a blast. Hit the boat with a shot. A strong shot off the crossbar. Some of them bounce down and in, and some like this one go out. Lundqvist is able to make what turns out to be a relatively routine butterfly stop. Toronto's got that win. Hatchets one. Stick to some. Propelled to Tavares. Handled with the stick. Good keep at the line. More attack coming. Puck collected. Carries it on in from center. Let's it go. That's a great save. I was watching for sticks to go up. No celebration this time. Let's it go. Lobs it. Outstanding save. Difficult opportunity. That was a good challenge. Better stop. The Maple Leafs have it at center ice. Got it at the point. With a blast. Blocked. New York's back in its own end, trying to work forward. Kreider's been like a one-man gang today. He's been all over the ice, and his number is all over the score sheet, too. The Maple Leafs are looking to make a play out of their own zone. Skates it into the zone. Intercepts that pass. Maybe he can generate something. A slot wrister. Got the pad on that one. That's a free puck thanks to the play by Kreider. And he steps across the line. Looking from the corner. Turned away with the stick. The Rangers look to make a difference up the wing. To the point it comes. Shoots. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. The goaltender shuts that one down and a superb opportunity. Collected in the corner. Pass to the blue line. Looks to make a play. Presses that attack. Point to point pass. Back at the blue line. They're getting all organized now. Skates it behind the net. Back to the blue line. Gets it back. Sends it all the way across. Fires. Didn't miss by much. From that position on the ice, he's got to hit the net. Make the goalie make a save. Right in front. Save. Steps across that line. Hammers one. Great glove save. We go down to the benches. It's Ray Ferraro. The Maple Leafs have played very well, but they've just had no finish to their opportunity, whether it's been a post, a crossbar, or the several times they've missed the net. Ray, I don't know if you believe in omens or not. One side says, well, it's got to change sometime, and another says, maybe not tonight. Toronto's got it again. Let's it rip. Great opportunity denied. It's dumped in. Goes back deep for it. Toronto's in possession now as they move up the wing. Let's it go. The lane was jammed and it hit somebody. And he dumps it in. Gathered up again by Muzzin. Gets in and he'll look over his options. Just missed the net. That's a tough one to watch. Need to practice hitting the net. Laid on to Hyman. Using the point. He's got it. Skates out with it. Collected at the boards. Tries in front. 
pass block. Right on his stick. Can he get it out? Really solid possession and pressure. Not done yet, though. That was a great play and goal. Uh, with this puck being so close to that, this is all a reactionary save. Turned aside with a pass. The Maple Leafs organizing back in their own end. Gives it over to the point. Scooped up by John Tavares. Cranks a blast! Got in the lane and blocked it. Toronto's got it in their own end, hoping for center. Gets in, looks over his options here. Say! The Rangers leave their own end. On to Faust. Smart recovery by Brown. Last minute to go in the third. Slid to Hyman. The Maple Leafs yank their goalie to try and get this back. All the pressure still on as they can't clear. Came through big time, hugging that post. The cage is vacant. Chance-taking time. So important to win the next face-off now. A big win. Let's see what happens. What a ripper from the point. May not have intended it, but it hit him. Oh, what a hit that one was. Oh, he thought he had more room to slide by him there. Nope, he got thumped. Puck sails over the glass, and we get the whistle. Mark Stahl's shoulder is right through the opposing player. That is a great hit. It's a face-off win. May not seem important in that territory, but they have possession. Outstanding job done at the blue line to hold the pressure on. Puck comes out of the zone, back to center ice, and so things will settle a bit. Skilled play by Mark Stahl. Not enough to get it out. There he goes, net empty. Let's take a chance here, they're saying. One last risky attempt to get back in this game. You pull the goalie, put an extra man out, and you should win the faceoff or you're in trouble. Net open. And the game is over. A two-goal victory. Anytime you can get that insurance goal, you can breathe a little bit easier as the time runs off the clock. So that is it for this one. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. For Eddie and Ray, Doc saying good night all.